Thank you so much once again. Uh, this is another new day, a day for us together. It is again No Please Class TV, a channel for you. I'm Claude, as usual, your helper, your facilitator. Please, today we are going to do and deal with another lesson, which is the uh, ordinal numbers. Last time you have seen uh, the part of it which was cardinal numbers. Today, let us deal with the uh, ordinal numbers. Now, as I promised you, I told you that I will give you the best. So, when talking about ordinal numbers, think about uh, the numbers that you need daily. When you say number, as you remember, numbers are divided into two categories, which is cardinal numbers, numbers and ordinal numbers last time we have recovered the cardinal numbers today our focus is on ordinal numbers but before i go on let me give you uh, a difference when you see This and this. Look at this, those example. Here, when I try to speak out this, this is one, this is two, this is three, the next one is a four. Okay, but when I jump there, you see this is first. Here second and the third lastly is the fourth. When you see those two categories, you see that they are very different. The first one we call it cardinal cardinal numbers. And the next one is the ordinal numbers. They are of the same family because all they are numbers, but they should be used in a different context. As you have seen, on cardinal numbers, we use them when we are counting. When you are counting one, two, three, we are counting things. We are counting people just that is when we can use just the what cardinal numbers and when we go to ordinal numbers as our focus of today those numbers are used when we are lacking when we want to express the degree and eh? how things are different when we want to express the quality mm? when you have for example a child at school uh, that is a motoni that is a motoni motoni who can be at school motoni is the first the first in her class wow she is the first in her class here I use the first Do you know? Example, do you know the second? The second one? Okay. When we consider those uh, two examples, in that I will give you more, you see here we are lacking. We have the first, the second, the third, the fourth, and so on. Here, do you know the second one? Do you know the second one? Means that there are many people, but they are different. Who is the first? Who is the second? 
That is where we use uh, ordinal numbers. So, by this, let's have just a quick review on those ordinal numbers. Quick review. Here we have Yeah, this is, I put the sign and the uh, RD, TH, 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 TH. And here, this one, I put SD, a light, and D, yes, here, it's okay. Next, if the age, all right, all right, and I continue again with this. Um, here I can say, right? Um, yes, it's okay, right? This number also, yes, okay, yes. Okay, I should also add th, 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 sd, th, th. Now look how those numbers are different. So let's work together and learn how we read those numbers. They are again ordinal numbers. This is, this is. First, sometimes we, we need to use the. Sometimes we, we need to use the. The first. Here it is the second. Alright, very good. This is the third. Third. That is the third. This is the fourth. Fourth. The fourth. This is the fifth, the fifth, the fifth, pay attention here, the fifth, that is a change. This is the C, six, the sixth, right, this is the C, the seventh, seventh, pay attention please. This is the eighth, eighth, that is another attention, pay attention here, not double T, it is one T. This is the ninth, all right. Here when E is lost, this is the ninth, all right? Pay attention here when you, you write this number. This is the tenth, tenth, right? TH, this is twentieth, twentieth. Twentieth, attention here, why change in IE? And twenty-first, the twenty-first. Twenty. First, I can put a dash of not 21st or 20, 22nd. All right, thank you. This is the 30th. The 30th. 30, 30th. Attention here again. This is the, the 40th. 40th. Why? Yes. And the next one is it? The 5th. The fifteenth. The fifteenth. Thank you. This is the sixteenth. All right. The sixteenth. Sixteenth. Okay. The next one is the say the seventeenth. Seventeenth. Thank you. This is the eighteenth. Eighteenth. It's okay. Very nice. 80. Next, this is the 90th. Right. The 90th. Pay attention here. This is the 100th. 100. 100. The 100 is nowhere. The next one is the, the 100. 100. The one hundred and the first. 
and the first it's okay and the first yeah there is yeah and the first yes the one hundred and the first this is the two hundred the two hundred two hundred thank you this is the one thousands one thousand the one thousand yes we have a list of numbers but before i continue let's uh, go and make a short review on this one before i continue with this it is wrong guys mass uh, numbers are illimited they are just many we cannot think so let's go to this one this is look at this the first the second the third the fourth the fifth the sixth the seventh the eighth the ninth the tenth the twentieth the twenty first twenty second thirtieth thirtieth fiftieth sixtieth seventieth eightieth nineteenth one hundred one hundred and the first two hundred and one thousand I wanted to show you one secret. When we are here in tens, normally this was why change in IE in writing. Then we add TH for tens. Yes, uh, from 20, 30, uh, 40. Yes, you know this one as a cardinal number, they are ended by Y. When you go to those ordinal numbers, this one change in RE. Then we add TH. That is how we form, that is how we make what the ordinal numbers from cardinal numbers. So let's continue by this. We take more examples. Um, after these one thousands, we have also this number. Ah, this is a big number. Okay, even in this one. Even in this one, which number is this one? That is one million. Okay, the one millions. We can use the however possible or not. One millions. One million. Okay, that is it. And this, this is one billions. Oh, one billion. You might be having this number also. What does it mean? From the first, from the first to one billion. I believe and I hope that you are able to write and uh, analyze each number between the circuit from here to there. How? I give some numbers randomly. Let me give you some numbers randomly. Okay. All right.
Okay? Yes. All right. That is some numbers. We take them randomly. So what? This is... Okay. Let's go together. Let's go together. Which number is this one? Uh, this is the knife. Remember? We don't put the ear. The knife. This is... Any of you? Yes. The knife. 19th. 19th, right? And this is the 100, 191st. It's okay. 91st. It's okay. Very nice. First. This is 205th. 205th and 5th 205th okay 205th this is 2045th right to 1000 and 14 5th that is it and this this is 1000 1000 100 100 Eleventh, eleventh. This is eleventh. We put the H. Eleventh, eleventh. Okay. This is seven thousand. Seven thousand seven hundred. Seven hundred seventy-seven. Seventy. Seventy seventh. The last number of it is a nine hundred thousand nine hundred thousand thousand four hundred hundred. Okay. Nine hundred thousand four hundred. Right. This is a pack of ordinal numbers. We cannot revise all numbers. We still have it just a long list. It is uncountable. But that is elemental uh, points that you need to know. When you know some of those ones, or not all of them, I think you'll be dealing with ordinal numbers as well as possible. Please, good lucky, and I wish you the best. Don't forget to subscribe on our channel because it is our, just our favorite, it is just our joy. When you subscribe, you share, you give a comment, they are making us just a great job in our parts. Thank you so much and nice day.